Today I'll be unboxing this 3080Ti FTW3 Hydro Copper version of this video card. All right, let's do this. The box is pretty much the same as any other 3080Ti. Um, it's a little bit thinner, as you can see. It's slightly thinner. Let's see what we have inside. Cool. Okay, the packaging is very similar to EVGA's other card models. The foam here is like way thicker. I noticed since uh, the card is a lot thinner. Uh, let's see what we have. Okay, you have a Allen wrench. I'm guessing this is for the stop fittings that are in the card right now. It's a little manual. Um, we don't need that. And you have this thing. Um, I can never figure out what this is. Uh, it's a retention bracket, whatever that is. So you get one of those. And that's pretty much it. And then you just have the card itself. Oh man, it's like wedged in there. Oh geez. Okay. So here is the card. Here's the side. As you can see, like the PCB is pretty much the same as all the other models because you can see the uh, little fan headers here. Um, looks like we have a couple of RGB headers. So if you want to attach more things to this you can. Uh, the water block itself is pretty nice. That's the back. And then you have the actual um, back plate. It looks like it looks pretty much the same as any other model to be honest. And that's gonna be the side profile of the card so yeah not anything special the only main difference is you get the water block already pre-installed so you don't have to worry about like applying the right level of thermal paste and things like that and that's pretty much it so i'm gonna go and install this now and replace my aging rtx 3080 all right